Where are all of you doing? Welcome back to the Crypto Blitz, your go-to place for all of your cryptocurrency needs. Ripple Van Winkle is your host for this event. I hope that everyone is enjoying a wonderful start to their weekend. I hope you have some different things in the works. It is going to be Saturday when you are going to do anything. I really hope that the hurricane did not have any impact on you. A great number of individuals in Florida were killed or injured. After seeing some photographs from Tampa, I believe that the Carolinas and Georgia were also hammered very hard by the lightning. Not long ago, they were inundated. I'm referring about this storm surge, which is completely unbelievable, folks. I believe that more than a million people in Florida were left without electricity as a result of this storm surge. I Not at all. Stay careful and use your head. Let's hope that everything is fixed as soon as possible. In addition, there is a lot going on in the cryptocurrency markets during this episode. To put it another way, come on Saturday, XRP is blowing up. I mean, what exactly is this, huh? During the week, it is not possible to do it. In spite of the fact that it is necessary to sneak it in on the weekend, I have you covered in that regard, it is going to be looked at by us. We are going to investigate the price of Bitcoin and how it might influence alternative cryptocurrencies. What about the outcome of XRP? Just do it. The good old Nike, how high could we possibly go for this? Furthermore, I have obtained the Ripple stablecoin tracker, and there is a significant amount of stablecoin being generated on the Ethereum network. I'm urging you to warm it up and get it ready. This stuff is going to be launched by them immediately. That's for sure. That is a highly bullish sign. Not to worry, I've got you covered without further ado. Let's dive into a Bitcoin transaction worth $65,751 within the last 24 hours. It has experienced a 0.43% increase. In the year 2673, Ethereum was released. In the past 24 hours, it has increased by 1.04%. Both USDT and USDC are releasing their dollar pegs at the same time as XRP boy. I can't believe it's flirting, exactly in the vicinity of the 62 cent level. The appearance is attempting to burst through. This is our first key resistance area and we are above it. Around 65 to 66, we received another one. We are going to make an effort to make a run at it today, and then we are going to try to target in that 75 cent region. One area down, two to go, and we are going to reach our goal. How are we going to proceed from here? I'm telling you, XRP time is getting close to the total market cap of all cryptocurrencies, which is 2 trillion 323 billion. Look at this, folks, it's entirely based on Bitcoin. Bitcoin serves as the base currency. Whatever we choose to call it, we can call it Pumptober or October. There are only a few days left until October arrives. Typically, when I say typically, when I say typically, we are talking about a strike rate of 80%, which indicates that October is in the purple. This is a place where we want to see the costs go up and skyrocket. It is our hope that Bitcoin will reach 100,000. It is important to keep in mind that the sentiment toward cryptocurrencies is very bullish, which is the question that a lot of people still have out there. Before the price of Bitcoin begins to skyrocket, is it possible that we will witness one last collapse? It's a crap game with a 50-50 chance of winning. Let's just be honest and say it as it is, shall we? You are going to either say yes, which means that we are going to go down, or you are going to say no, which means that we are not going to lower ourselves. Moreover, one person is going to appear to be a hero, while another person will not. You must be aware that this is one of the most secure wagers that you can make in the world of betting, right? You might consider any wager that is 5050 to be among the finest odds that you have available to you. I mean, even roulette isn't a perfect game, isn't it? And it is dark. The color is crimson. Moreover, it is green. The reason they include the green is because it has the potential to change your odds. This is how easy it is. In my opinion, what do you believe will take place? I don't think so, but let's see, Bitcoin is still making progress. It is necessary for us to see the outcome of this chop. So far, it has been in this zone. At this particular zone, it has been chopping. For us to be able to claim that the waters are safe, we absolutely need to get out of this zone and go over the $72,000 region. On the other hand, for the time being, we are merely circling about and splashing around while playing in there. There is no way for us to know what may result from this situation. Now, if you are interested in getting yourself some with a number like 50 or 70, I don't even know. It's just ridiculous with those numbers. The price is significantly lower than that at 25 XRP. A cup of any size that is 30 ounces can be purchased for 22 XRP. Every one of them is etched. Including lids for all of them, the 40 ounce bottle comes with both the straw and the lid, and the price for the 40 ounce bottle is approximately 34, or I believe it's around 31 XRP. There is free shipping anywhere in the globe, the whiskey glasses and the whiskey cups are both on sale, and everything else is going to be on sale as well. The merchandise has to be moved, and it is moving at a breakneck pace. I have been unable to even keep track of all the orders that have been rolling in over the past three days. It is going to be necessary for us to get rid of all of them in order to make way for the autumn and winter items. Put away all of the summery items and get them out of the store. Utilize it to your advantage. It costs $14.99 for a tumbler that holds 30 ounces, folks. Where are you going to look for that? There is a wide variety of colors available and it is engraved with XRP, 
Check it out at shopexpritenow.com and see what you think. It is anticipated that the cryptocurrency market would experience a boom in liquidity during the fourth quarter of this year. With regard to what we have been discussing, with regard to what we have been. Preaching on this channel fourth quarter is expected to be the most bullish phase for cryptocurrency. It is stated that the current spike in the price of Bitcoin has reached 65,000, which is a significant milestone. Nevertheless, a recent analysis indicates that this surge is just the beginning of a possibly tremendous price bubble that could occur in the future. It is expected that the projected spike will be propelled by the return of regular investors as well as an influx of billions of dollars from the Chinese markets. Over the course of this episode, we have spent a lot of time discussing the Chinese market recently, and it appears that China is about to give the go-ahead for their investors for their retail and institutional clients to enter the cryptocurrency market. China is the second largest economy in the world, and we want that money to flow in. After that, we will get Japan to flow in, and with the United States beginning to flow in, we are going to see new all-time highs across the board for cryptocurrencies. The states in question the current increase in the price of Bitcoin may be related to the reduction of the Federal Reserve's benchmark interest rate by 50 basis points earlier this year. It has come to our attention that all of the coins are bursting. The acceleration of stablecoin minting and the Chinese over-the-counter brokers reporting billions of dollars in inflows both point to the possibility of further rise. We foresee a rapid climb towards 70,000, followed by new all-time highs in the almost immediate future, as a result of Bitcoin breaking above the 65,000 mark. I can give you my word that it seems as though they are taking exactly what I am saying and putting it into these articles. For a considerable amount of time I have been preaching this. Just recently this article was introduced to the public. It is truly insane. When Bitcoin reaches 72,000 it will begin to rip. We are going to see a pullback if we are unable to break 72 in the very first shot. What I'm searching for is exactly that. There has been no deviation. Great to it's like crypto is saying, hey, just do it. What if this Nike formation actually comes to fruition? Let's say we just play and slowly follow this line all the way up until we reach a price of $13 for XRP. What would that mean? I'm sorry, but 8 to 13 is not. Not even a remote possibility for the bull run of XRP TIS. 100% is not completely out of the question it is being considered. Where do we go to get there? To put it simply, we end the year with a profit of more than 75 cents. It is actually better if we close at a higher level. And if we can get to a region of approximately $1.50, that would be ideal. And then we will have the opportunity to witness this. In the event that we are able to surpass 75 cents, what will it imply? In other words, it indicates that in the years 2016 and 2020, when XRP saw a breakout of these zones, and I will demonstrate to you in a moment, we were able to see 6% of the total market cap of all cryptocurrencies. If we take a look at the amount of money that we estimate is going to flow into cryptocurrency this year, or the year after that, I should say, I should say in 2025, we are looking at seven to $10 trillion. What you see is the projection. If we were to achieve a market cap dominance of 6%, which would be between 7 and 10 trillion, we would have at least $6 worth of XRP. Those are the targets, and in fact, I am focusing my attention on them. To put it simply, that is the bare basic. We witnessed the pinnacle of the parabolic blow-off in the years 2016 and 2017. Despite the fact that we did not receive a parabolic blow-off top in the year 2020, everything is pointing in the direction that we will see those parabolic blow-off peaks during this bull cycle for the majority of the markets. In the event that XRP achieves a market cap domination of 6%, as it has done in every other bull cycle that I have participated in, we will reach a minimum price of $6. There is a possibility that a parabolic blow-up top intends to target the $13 range for XRP. In particular, I want you to focus on that particular aspect. At this point, I would like to conclude this discussion on the regulation and your new exchange. Regarding the restrictions that are in place for equities, do you anticipate that they will also be in place for commodities and other things that are traded on your new exchange? Though I believe it will go at a more leisurely pace, I believe that eventually commodities and stocks will kind of sort of blend over a considerable amount of time, perhaps over the course of 20 years. Um, I mean, let's be honest, they just don't have the slightest idea how to deal with crypto and digital whatever. 